Lindsay LaCosto is the deputy mayor for the city of Evansville, and she is here. This is such an exciting time. Oh, it Historic. Is. Yeah, exciting time for sure yeah it's a big year isn't it big big, big first 100 days um, kind of leading up to the eclipse so. and so when is the 100 days for mayor terry completed on um eclipse actually day? on eclipse day and then the next day she's <laughs> giving timing. her state of the city address at rotary so we've been very busy the past 90 days or so uh, you know she has her 100 day roadmap that we've been just check marking off those things and it's just been Angie it's been so wonderful it's just been so rewarding she's such an amazing person uh, we have such an amazing leader for our community for the city of Evansville uh, I'm just so excited to to work alongside her and the team that she's uh, has in place which has been been fantastic I, th I think that so often we don't as the public know about all of those those thoughts that have to be filled right I mean it's not like automatic right. <laughs> it's right. got to be Done and it's got to be done thoughtfully. It does, it does. And Mayor Terry, she's done a really fantastic job of setting out a wide net, uh, of bringing in the right people for her team. It, I think she's done it in a way, if you ask people in the community, that hasn't been the traditional uh, way that maybe people would have gone about it, but she's really looking for the best candidates for each role within those different departments and there's so many departments within the city of Evansville um, and, and again she's found people that are passionate that love the city love the community and love what they do so it's just been um, a wonderful three months and I'm just still so honored that I get to be a part of it well I know it's an exciting time in your life as well and here you are in these these historic women uh, right. leading the city at this historic time here in the uh, who could have arranged the eclipse for the time that you're in office? So what's the conversation been like about plan safety, handling all the people, all the traffic? You know, the region as a whole has done a fantastic job of really getting ahead of the planning for the eclipse. These, in my last role, these conversations had started over a year ago. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um, so this is something that has been uh, in the making for a while. But the meetings that we've been a part of, a lot of safety meetings, meeting with police department, fire department, uh, EMA, just making sure that the answers to the what ifs are in place. Um, and I think our team and as around the city and, and surrounding communities are thinking of every possible scenario of what could happen and making sure that that uh, the citizens are, are going to be safe no matter where they watch the eclipse from. And so. there are great vantage points all around oh, the tri-state. Right, you can see right. that totality map. I mean, it's, it's a pretty sweeping yes. map all the way around. And you and I mentioned before we came on about, okay, the eclipse is over. Stay put. Right. Don't get in a rush. I think that's the one thing, uh, the traffic, especially if you are downtown, as we know, there's some construction going on downtown right now. Uh, and Riverside will be closed for the event downtown. So just enjoy the food trucks, enjoy the event, enjoy the afternoon with friends, family, coworkers, whoever you may be celebrating with, and just enjoy the, the community and all of the things that our uh, community has to offer while you have that afternoon after the eclipse. Can people still get the glasses? Oh, yes. There are glasses. Glasses. Um, I know uh, Adam Trinkle at uh, downtown Evansville has glasses for sale. There's a lot of places. The library has glasses as well. So I don't think there is, as of today, a shortage of glasses out there. You just, yep. Get those can, safety ones, though. Yes, You've got you to have, have the to, right ones. And one. you cannot use, I've heard, I've read, I've been told, you cannot use from 2017. Those are, it's basically like old sunscreen. You know, it, it, right. they expire. Right. So get make new sure ones. you get new glasses. <laughs> yes. Protect your eyes. Yes. Thank you, Lindsay. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. We'll be back with more local lifestyles right after this. Stay with us.